Psalm 118 begins with four assertions that the Lord's mercy endures forever and then goes on to encourage a strong trust in the Lord. This is a psalm full of confidence with expressions such as I shall not die but live and declare the works of the Lord and Thou art my God and I will thank Thee. Thou art my God and I will praise Thee. However, the best known words in this psalm are as follows. The same stone which the builders refused is become the headstone in the corner. These words are seen by Christians as pointing to Jesus and are quoted extensively in the New Testament. Jesus, who was rejected by the people in so many ways, turned out to be the person who ensures that God's saving purposes are secure just as the keystone holds an entire bridge in place. O oh, give thanks unto the Lord, for he is gracious, because his mercy endureth forever. Let Israel now confess that he is gracious, and that his mercy endureth forever. Let the house of Aaron now confess that his mercy endureth forever. Yea, let them now that fear the Lord confess that his mercy endureth forever. I called upon the Lord in trouble, and the Lord heard me at large. The Lord is on my side. I will not fear what man doeth unto me. The Lord taketh my part with them that help me. Therefore shall I see my desire upon mine enemies. It is better to trust in the Lord and to put any confidence in man. It is better to trust in the Lord than to put any confidence in princes. All nations compassed me round about, but in the name of the Lord will I destroy them. They kept me in on every side, they kept me in, I say, on every side, but in the name of the Lord will I destroy them. They came about me like bees, and are extinct even as a fire among the thorns, for in the name of the Lord I will destroy them. Thou hast thrust sore at me that I might fall, but the Lord was my help. The Lord is my strength and my song, and is become my salvation. The voice of joy and health is in the dwellings of the righteous, the right hand of the Lord bringeth mighty things to pass. The right hand of the Lord hath the preeminence. The right hand of the Lord bringeth mighty things to pass. I shall not die but live and declare the works of the Lord. The Lord hath chastened and corrected me, but he hath not given me over unto death. Open me the gates of righteousness, that I may go into them and give thanks unto the Lord. This is the gate of the Lord, the righteous shall enter into it. I will thank thee, for thou hast heard me, and art become my salvation. The same stone which the builders refused is become the headstone in the corner. This is the Lord's doing, 
and it is marvellous in our eyes. This is the day which the Lord hath made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Help me now, O Lord. O Lord, send us now prosperity. Blessed be he that cometh in the name of the Lord. We have wished you good luck, ye that are of the house of the Lord. God is the Lord who hath showed us light. Find the sacrifice with cords, yea, even unto the horns of the altar. Thou art my God, and I will thank thee. Thou art my God, and I will praise thee. O give thanks unto the Lord, for he is gracious, and his mercy endureth for ever.